it is a beautiful misty morning and I'm up a bit earlier than normal because we're going to try and get three loads of cars into a scrapyard in Northampton which means I've got to move quite a lot of stuff um, CVRT for a start trailer for a start yeah a lot of stuff really uh, not quite sure how I'm going to do it but that CVRT is going to have to go for a start I think the best thing I can do is get on the digger and start um, what's the best way uh, I think that I think that storm has got to be dragged out of the way that would work and then I'll just lift the cars over the bank with a big digger hmm yes I think that's the way well it's a bit like the Mary Celeste here I am Billy no mates five past nine in fact past that the uh, low loader was supposed to be here at eight o'clock start loading the cars so they could get three trips into the scrapyard 650 pound haulage not too impressed really and uh, they're not even here so if they don't get three three trips it's even worse yes i want to have a tidy up we've got lots of these cars laying around not these two these would be crushed on um on saturday the twin half day but all this stuff along the side there um we're trying to do three lots of seven and this lot over here as well shame really because um i ran them over sideways if they were good runners i ran them over sideways like that for sat shame to weigh it in really because the whole front end's good and we could have sold a few bits off that maybe but um, i can't motivate me polish lad who likes to uh, take things off and sell them i think he's just too loved up i think he's exhausted through all these women that keep chasing him all the while and um he, he just can't he just walks along with his knuckles dragging along the ground soon it'll be his bottom lip dragging along the ground but these are nice Craig, if you're watching, that's your puppy. And then over there, Carl, that's your puppy. And they're both gonna get it tomorrow. I think that this uh, stormer, I'm gonna get actually to tow that onto the island. And I suppose really, as I'm sitting here twiddling me dick, I may as well back that chieftain up and put it in first position for um, the crush on Saturday. Oh, and I've got three spaces left. Unusually in the afternoon, it's always the afternoon ones that sell first. But there you go. Three places left. If you want a special deal, talk to me direct and I'll get you driving a tank tomorrow. We've got Armoury and uh, you might be crushing one of these cars if you're any bloody good. The Scarlet Pimpernel. So what we're going to do is um, put the lorry in here nice and tight yeah. and start lifting him on the back. Right, how do you want me filming? Because I'm driving. Yeah, it doesn't matter, does it? I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, driving. Got yeah, a red are. Citroen like this, and you've had a little bump on the front end, and you need a perfect spoiler. You've got about 15 minutes to ring me, and I'll take it off for you. But you've got 15 minutes. In fact, you haven't, because I'll post this tonight, so you'll be behind. Well, it's just life, isn't it? It's just life. But what a shame. What a waste. I like to recycle a little bit off every car, even if it's just a bit of chewing gum stuck on the uh, sun visor which brightens my day for five minutes. Here he comes. Dun, 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 da, 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 dun, 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 dun. Have you ever seen that series called Eddie Stoppard? Sometimes they go around the corner and it's really exciting. Some people just wet themselves when they're watching it. I don't, but some people do. They just go absolutely crazy because, you know, getting around a corner can be tricky. It's not going on white grass, is it? Yeah, sensible sort of thing. We'll get plenty of cars on there. If we go nine high, I could get like 40 on there, perhaps. Jobs are good. Oh, boy, that is. You can handle the low bill. Craig, don't worry about your car. He's not going to scratch it. That's my boy. I'm proud of that boy. We're getting on. We're getting on. I think yeah, he's doing really well. And uh, we were looking to get a 7 on, 1, 2, 3, 4, uh, 6, we'll get 7 on it, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, yeah! So what I'll do is I'll take a movie of these and I'll put forward on the B5s. It's hard getting the chains off the high ones. Even the sky. 
Let's see what the boys are eating. There must be something nice going. Surprise. It's Friday pizza day. Oh, I don't like bacon roll a lot. Oh, you're still drinking that red diesel? Oh, so what's planned? What's planned? Um, Just eat. Deliver go anywhere. Go home Poets. early, it's Friday. Yeah. Go, would it be lovely? Poets. Oh, early. microwave. Hey, eh? how cool oh, is that? Yeah. And you got the Christmas decorations out as well, getting ready. Well done. Well, it is September. In length. The problem is the lorry is five feet away from the grass, and that five feet is everything. Without that, I am lucky. But all in all, we've done really well. We've all been a lot less of snack and four, and that'll be it for snack and four. Some of them are so flat, you, uh, you wouldn't know. But unless he does it properly and parks near the grass, I ain't never going to get that car on. Because when I crown my bucket, it makes it so it goes sideways. And that is a bummer. Right, green Suzuki Vitara. Um, and then we've got a Vauxhall Van Orange. And then we've got a Fiat Punto, I think it is. And that one there is a Subaru Silver. The design is a Vauxhall Cavalier. That is a day roof, that goes back a long way. Then there's a white Berlingo van. There is a Renault, or oh, maybe a Elf, I don't know what it is. Then there's a Honda Civic. And squashed between them is another one of them uh, Suzuki Jeeps. Right, I've got to find the V5 now and send them on. He did a jolly fine job. He worked short out the bus from the back of his door. Oh, too late. Yeah, that's the. A lot, uh, a lot tidier for the uh, twin half day. Now all we've got to do is back him out onto the road. And that won't be much fun. Yes, a busy day. I don't know how many times I climbed up and down to get into that cab. It must have been 50 or 60 times at least. The chains come off. Oh, nightmare, nightmare. What do you do with your old diesel that you're testing? No, he's not having a wee in it. Well, it could be. You find a weed that is um, specifically in the middle of some tarmac and you put some diesel on it and trust me, it really does bugger them up. Right, do them we'll, bits of grass as yeah, well. We'll, we'll check. Yeah, you can get weed killer, but um, trust me, diesel is a good one on your um, on your asphalt when you it weed It takes a little bit through. longer, I think. But well, it does the, if the you've got a 100 acre venue. It does last forever. And you could say it's quite expensive to do, but nothing will, nothing will live there for quite a while. It's a shame that diesel's not in the lawn mode, then I could finish the lawn. Anyway, we thought, as we've had a big old clear up over there, it'd be quite nice to put our um, Russian, what is it? Uh, BTR6, no. BNP or? A BNP1. Uh, yeah. Or it could be a two or a three. It's, it's I can't remember. Czechoslovakian, well, it could be Czechoslovakian, yes. Yeah. All we know is it's a wonderful thing to drive. That, it's the ISIS drift tank. The ice, yeah, the ISIS drift tank. If the no fastest. One, if no one's watched that video, the it's fastest brilliant. troop carry in the world, apparently. They've not driven a slingshot. No, they've not driven our slingshot, that's true. And technically, that is now a troop carrier. Right, we're going under here, will be a bung, because there is quite a lot of water in the hull, and that can never be a good thing. But luckily, it's so new, everything's smeared in grease. I noticed the lights are on, that's probably not a good thing either. Um, it might be a bung that you do from inside. That'd be clever, wouldn't it? And it is clever. There's no doubt about it, it is clever. I mean, that water deflector on the front, that probably goes pneumatically. I really hope that's done from the inside because it's a bloody cross-up. It's a what? It's a, it's a flat screw. Oh, God. And yeah. Like big. Something on the inside. Let me have a look. Yeah. 
arms are strong, some are meant for the time, the fitting rubber pads that are super tight on the road. I mean, we need to at some point, really, don't we? It'd be rude not to. No, I mean, we need, we need to take it on the road. Oh, a bit full of water. Pedal harder. I don't know which one it is. Oh! Yeah, I'm doing that one as well. That whack-a-mole. Ashley's just got to move his Jaguar. They give it a little bit of love at the back. It's looking a little bit low. Give it a minute and it'll go up on its air. That is the problem. It looks like it's going up. Very, very slowly. Oh my god, lucky it hasn't been hit with my driving. And uh, I think we're about ready for tomorrow. Me Humvee's got me tools in. This has been mown by her ladyship. She did a wonderful job. All the vehicles are set out. We've moved a few. I've kind of scurried the ground up a bit so it doesn't look uh, oily and horrible or anything like that. And um, Fast and Furious is all serviced and there's a car there waiting to be run over and then there's another one over there waiting to be run over. I only picked that up on Thursday, you'd be pleased to see it run over. He, uh, it was a bastard, basically. Uh, we've had a tidy round here, done all the dustbins, fed the robin and um, yes, yes, lots of work, lots of work. These are all kind of being tested really and if they, um, if 60 people can't break them then um, I know where they're going. They'll all be painted. Beautiful, this is. Look at the inside of that. Really nice. They're not all like that. They're all the same price, but they're not all the same quality. So you have to take a bit of the rough with the smooth. This is a pretty good one too. Whenever you see a white interior, you know it's a late rebuild. They always used to use silver, but it used to rub off on the clothing. We'd probably use the Safari as, um, as a taxi because it's a damn good taxi on a hot day. Yes, and it's all looking good. And I even changed the uh, first page of the photo calendar. I actually went all the way to Wales to pick that up. I bid on it on eBay, didn't realize who it was. And it was going a bit manky on the first page. Many of the photos are upside down, but um, uh, Dom Jolly and uh, all sorts of, a beautiful wedding we did for somebody in Brackley uh, with the tank limo. I think they're now divorced, but there we go. You can't have everything. Uh, eating sheds already. Everything laid out, um, polished the biscuits, all the planes, we haven't polished them, but uh, there we go. Yeah, all looking good. I think we're ready. Uh, Kate sold a few more tickets. I might only have one left, two at the most. Be interesting if the Humvee lasts another day. Quite remarkable. What I'd love to do now is um, Sunday, I'd love to go up the river in my river over, but oh, I don't know, I bet it don't happen. We'll wait till the weather gets horrible then, then it'll be suggested. I love my river rover. It's amazing that a little bike like that can... Oh, two people. Ding, 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 Yes, everything we wanted as a child we couldn't have. And wanted to do but couldn't do, Jackson will have and will do, I guess. Okay, well, the slingshot's been chugging a bit of power into the old girl for about 45 minutes. That should be enough. Um, not started for a long, long time, and that's a real shame because it's incredible fun, but I just haven't got the time to play. But I think the display tomorrow will be lovely up near the shed. Well, it's all kind of very, very shiny inside, really. I mean, it's all very new looking and um, quite complicated in the starting of the thing, but um, I can just about remember it. I'm pretty certain it's not in gear, but uh, it's column shift like a kind of a Japanese van. No, it's not going to have it. Well, I don't think it is anyway. No, it needs new batteries. You can air start them, but unfortunately, me compressed, me compressed air bottles aren't full. I think 
get fired then. I think we're going to have to give up. What a shame. We had a good old tidy today. I got 11 on one load, but um, I want to move all these cars and I reckon there's about 80. Um, we'll just stop listening now. It's just about that time. They've really got like, a tremendous appetite and all sorts of things living. Sometimes magic, my Polish friend. But um, time never gone, time never gone. 